Here I am, somewhere, somewhere cool, as you can see, with Gourd Banjo number 20. This is a commission build. It's built just like number 19. Or is that, that's 18. Built just like number 18, which was the last video. Um, it's got the same cherry fingerboard, cherry burl, same piece of walnut. I used the same, uh, from the same length of walnut. The difference is the gourd is a bit bigger and instead of being um, 20, 23 inch scale length, so short scale, this is a full scale length, 26 and a quarter inches. And um, yeah, it's really nice. It sounds really great. And then the main other difference with this, you can see I've got my amp here. I've got a pickup in this. I've got a little cheap little piezo pickup in this thing. Um, the person who bought this is going to bring their own pickup and we're gonna swap it out. <clears throat> so for now it's a it's a cheaper pickup, but but oops I bumped the mic. But it's pretty cool. It's the first time I've done this in a gourd banjo. Hold on, there's a plane going by. That was uh, that was just straight through the amp recorded, and then of course I'm gonna do some overdrive because it's cool. You get some pretty wow. I'm t this is just the sound through the amp. I'm talking it, so I guess it's basically a contact mic. I don't really know how this works. All I know is that it was like three dollars, so it's kind of weird. Weird for it to be. Oh, yeah.
I don't know if that's going to be a complete mess or what. This is a, actually really fun. This is the first time I've messed with it like this. It's uh, yeah. Sorry to anyone who I don't know. If, <coughs> sorry to anyone who wanted to hear a, an accurate portrayal of what this banjo sounds like. Oh yeah, it's got these nice um, uh, Gota planetary tuners. I'm really happy with these. Highly recommend. They are a bit on the pricier side. Um, what else about this thing? Yeah, this is a uh, this cherry fingerboard. I've got only I think two more pieces of it, so it's going fast. If anyone likes what they see, you better yeah don't wait to hit me up because I've got I think only two more, and then I I don't have another. It's a very unique piece of wood. I don't I don't really have another source for it. Um, what else was I gonna say? Thank you. 
this sounds as good as it does through the headphones right now. If not, I'll just use uh, the audio from this mic and it won't sound, it'll just sound normal probably. All right, I gotta play it normally. I gotta play it, <clears throat> I gotta play it normal here. Hold it, hold on. I could do this all night on the distortion. It's, I think I'm gonna put one of these in like most of, most of what I do, what I make from now on, cause it's like, I don't know. <laughs> it's very fun. It's very fun to have the distortion going. But the party's got to end because, well, I don't know. Maybe I'll just make this one really long video. I'll do a short version and a long version. Mostly been doing claw hammer on this thing because it's really nice. Man, this thing is nice. I um, almost hate to give these up sometimes, but uh, yeah, I'm only I've only had a couple days with this, and then it's uh, it's off off to a very good owner. Thanks for watching.